Here's how to use the get fetch command. The get fetch command is used to fetch updates from a remote repository, but it does not merge or modify the contents of your current working directory. Here I have a clone repository from a git repo I downloaded a few weeks ago, and I'm sure they've made some changes. If I do a git log dash n, you can see the last commit I have. Let me run git fetch. A git pull will do a fetch and a merge. All I did was a fetch. And if I run git status, I will see no changes. So what happened? And what is the next step? Git fetch essentially brings your copy of the remote repo up to date, but does not change your local repository. The next step would be to review the changes, then merge if there's no issues. If I run, in this case, git diff branch remote repository name and the same branch. I can see all the differences between what was fetched and my local repo. If I'm okay with that, I can quit out of that and simply run git merge. Running git fetch versus git pull can give you some breathing room to review and decide what to do next before merging. And there you go. It's that easy. Subscribe for more and unleash the whiteboard coder in you.